Hello guys! We are back again! Okay, we were at number 17 yesterday, but today I see, I've seen some bowling ball or something. Mm. I don't know what it is, but it stands here. And if you look rather close, closely, I mean cozy, <laughs> closely, you can see it is a coconut. So, maybe a beer with some coconut in it. And it is a can. Oh, vocation. Who doesn't know vocation, guys? Northern Lights, coconut and marshmallow stout. 7.4% ABV. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Again, some great ABV beers, guys. That's amazing. Okay. I'm going to grab myself a glass and taste it, guys. Oh, yeah. Good start. Creamy head. Very creamy head. Look at that carbonation, guys. Those micro foam bubbles. Like you can see, really micro. The creamy, it's a creamy head. It is jet black. Damn. This is not a dream. Vocation, don't disappoint me this time. <laughs> but uh, they are making quite some great beers. We gotta dive in. Cheers, guys. Marshmallow. Exact marshmallow, that caramel thing to it. That's up front, the caramel, some coffee. The coconut, that's really hard to detect because you have to put in, during fermentation or after fermentation, you have to put in so much coconut. Uh, it's gonna be a coconut flavor or something, coconut syrup they thrown in there. I'm definitely sure of that because you have to, <laughs> you have to throw in otherwise, I don't know, pounds and pounds of coconuts if you use like these pieces of coconut or even those uh, flakes or something. But uh, yeah, I don't know what they use, but it definitely looks good. The cream is, look at that lazy guys. Look at this. It's really so creamy. It sticks in the glass a long time. You see? Till it's gone. Damn, we gotta dive in. Cheers guys. It does smell way better than it tastes. Oh no. On the nose. So much marshmallow, that caramel. Now, taste wise, red fruits. I do get a lot of red fruits, cherries. And if you look into the light, most of the time you can see a red shine. This is jet black. But there are definitely cherries in this one. It's sweet. It is full, the mouthfeel feels full, it's creamy, lactose, and the milky thing, milk, they used uh, the lactose. Like I said, the coconut, when you say, okay, there is coconut in there, then, you, then your mind is tricking yourself, yeah, yeah, you think, oh yeah, there is coconut in there, although you really can taste it, Ow. but it's just a hint. Uh, now that I know there is coconut in there, I maybe get a hint indeed. Um, but the marshmallows are really on the back now. Uh -oh. The coffee is more on the back. The red fruits up front. The creaminess, of course, the mouthfeel is there. Spicy. Cinnamon. Maybe some nutmeg. But... Red fruits up front, really guys, really. That's a shame. I was expecting a creamy, really marshmallow, like caramel tasting. The, the thickness of the beer, the creaminess, the mouthfeel is perfect. The taste doesn't feel okay to me. It still is a nice beer. I, I gotta tell, it's a nice beer. I'm still gonna give it, although I am, 
yeah. Talking so much bad about it, uh, I'm still gonna give it 7.25 out of 10. So it's one of the better beers. Although I talked some bad things about it, it isn't really too bad. But it isn't great also, in my opinion. Uh, I had much, 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 much better ones. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna leave you guys. Thanks for watching and don't forget, a beer dick is up to a ray. Cheers.